Okay. So the story is, there was a father who used to think that he does everything. And he became an egoist man. Like this. Nose in the air. See my nose in the air. Okay. So then, uh, he was, he became proudy and he was a teacher. So he himself one day realized that I am becoming proudy and what should I do? So he went to a Guruji. Guruji said, if you think that you, you are the one, come to see, you are the one who does everything and because of you the family is surviving of oh, I like it. Poppy! You're telling a story. Oh, sorry, I forgot. I just like sometimes pushing. Stop it! Uh, yeah, I like it a lot, but okay, let's stop it. Are we talking like a YouTuber? Yeah. <laughs> I think so. Okay, what do you So, I then, the Guruji said that, I can't remember. Let me touch my thinking hat. Yeah, now I remember. Guruji said that you should try leaving the house and then see the world doesn't stop. Family doesn't stop. Nothing stops. You go away and tell some, just make them believe that you're missing, you're absconding. Still the world doesn't end. And then you will believe that you are nobody. So don't think you are the one. What makes them survive is God, their own karma, everything else, and you are just a doer. So he did the same. He he sent a message to the family that I'm leaving the house and going, and he went away. He went away, and for one month or two months, he never came. Did you understand the story? Okay. Because I just saw you sleeping and I thought, let me wake you up. <laughs> I don't like kids, don't listen to me. Are you okay? Yes. Are you I sure? Was, yes, I was not sleeping. Oh, I just thought your eyes were closed and I didn't like it. Okay, okay should I continue? Yes. So, oh, you want, why? You want any other of my punches? <laughs> No. Uh, okay, okay, fine. So okay. then uh, he went away. Okay. And for one or two months, initially the family was crying, they were sad, and then things moved on. His wife also picked up a job, and his kids also started not missing. They were missing the father, but they went on with life. That's when he realized that things don't stop. He's just a small maybe one small person the whole universe and if he's gone people will miss him but but things don't stop life goes on so he then came back and uh, he told us he said i'm sorry i got very egoist and then guruji asked me to do these things and everybody was so happy to see him and then he just left his ego he became humble and and life went on so, what is the moral of the story? And if you don't say it correctly, remember Vikram Betar? So, you are the king, Vikram, and I am Betar. If you don't tell me moral of the story properly, I will run away. What is the moral of the story? I don't have time to listen to Aam, Aam. That's it, that's uh, be nice. Huh? Be nice. Be nice? No, no egoist. Oh, yeah! Good job! <laughs> I'll be sleeping with you. And I'll be with you. Ah. I'm Betal. <laughs>